Hey friends, Tux here. I am super pumped. I got another Zanny box here. Of course, Zanny box is the monthly pin collecting service where you sign up and they send you a cool little package, a purple package of pins each month. And it's really fun to see what they have because they have such good artists that pick really cool, relevant pop culture items, video game items. Like you just don't know what's going to be in here, but they pick some really cool stuff. And I have to say also thank you to everyone I met at BlizzCon. I really enjoyed doing pin trading there and I gave out some Zanny box pins as well. And also also, in my next giveaway, I'll be giving out some mystery pins to the lucky winner, okay? So there'll be more information about the giveaway coming up, but you could say, enter me in this video and get your name in the hat to be a lucky winner, okay? All right, let's go ahead and see what we have in this brand new Zanny box. I got my trusty scissors here. We'll go ahead and give this little guy a clippy clippy and see what we have. I'm gonna be very careful not to clip the pins. Pin trading is such a fun hobby, guys. Like, with the holidays coming up, Zanny Box will make an excellent gift for somebody or trade some pins. You know, find someone's favorite thing, like let's say it's turtles or something, and then go ahead and have some cool pins that go along with some of their favorite music or hobbies or whatever, video games. Like, it's really, really fun. Uh, they have a little letter here. Hello, subscribers. Um, I won't read through the whole letter because uh, I don't want to do spoilers, but they always pick some really, really cool stuff. So I can't wait to see. And Merry Christmas to you too, Zanny Box. <laughs> All right, let's see what we have here this week, guys. Um, like last month had such good things. And with the Christmas coming, who knows what fun new series I'll have. And I hope if I had a, a wish list for this package, I really got into the Harry Potter pin they said last time. So if you want to check that out, just go back like one video on my queue and you can see the cool Harry Potter pin they sent. And I hope, I hope there's another one. Let's find out. Okay, and our first pin for this particular Zany box is... Oh, it's G.I. Joe. That is so cool. It's a bad guy. It's Destro. Uh, they've been doing G.I. Joe for a while now. And I actually, I have a whole little collection of Joe pins. So I really am happy they continue this. I thought this might have been the end of the series. They're starting some new series coming up. But that is cool. It's awesome to have a Destro. He's definitely a, a well-known bad guy for Cobra. And um, I hope they continue the show. Like, I'd love to see some more. And again, I'd love to have the Knowledge is Power pin. I think that'd be a really cool idea for... It's not a character, but I think it'd be kind of fun to end the series with that but that's just my little wish list item but very cool let's go ahead and open this up and we'll take a closer look at destro and all of his glory let's see here glory for cobra and i do love the way the zany box give pins on these beautiful little collector cards with artwork and uh, everything and talks about what it is and even says like enemy weapons supplier so kind of give you a little backstory on the history of the character and of course that is Destro and also I did love the way Zany Box have really nice little rubber stoppers too that's a really nice little touch um, I found that when trading Zany Box pins it's really cool to keep them on the cardboard it kind of makes them even more tradable and that way people immediately kind of know what it is and some people actually I like I like wearing pins but sometimes people will actually keep their pins on the cardboard or even in the plastic sleeve as a collectible too so that's another idea for you but very very cool um, thank you Zanebox that's a fantastic add to my Joe collection all right let's see what else we have here oh, I'm all butterfingers today I'm actually getting over a cold at BlizzCon I did catch the cold a little bit so if my voice starts crackling out I do want to apologize in advance all right pin number two let's see what we have I'm best guessing back to the future maybe maybe let's see Oh, Kylo Ren, how relevant, man. Oh my God, I'm loving the new Star Wars on Disney+. Plus. I don't know if you guys have been watching that, but really, really good. Uh, the Mandalorian? Yeah, yeah. Um, I don't want to do spoilers, so I don't want to talk about it exactly, but um, a good series. I recommend it, and I'm really looking forward to the new Star Wars. I can't wait to see what happens in the saga of Kylo Ren to find out, does he turn good guy? Does he not? Like, I'll be wearing this bad boy when I go see Star Wars. Um, this is a really cool pin. I'm definitely loving the artwork. I love the red around the exterior. Uh, really nice glossy paint to check that out really really good looking and cool card stock too with his his signature lightsaber so very nice the back of course nice black rubber stopper and just looking really cool on this card so very cool this is like thick card stock too so really fun collectible um i hope you do more star wars like i'm definitely into star wars if you guys haven't seen i do have a star wars video which i actually i take a lot of heat for of some old star wars toys of mine that i made a long time ago even before this trilogy um <laughs> if you want to check out the video it's my cue um i think it's about like 700 50,000 views or something um, but it's my my actual Star Wars toys and I kind of forgot what a few of the ships were called and people give me a little bit of a hard time so if you do watch that video please show me a little love and say Tux it's okay you know you're a Star Wars fan because actually I am but I just hadn't at the point of making the video I hadn't seen Star Wars for quite a while all right 
reeling this back in. Let's see what our pin number three is. I'm thinking, I'm hoping Harry Potter. Let's see here. Pin number three is, oh my gosh, it's Super Mario. That is so cool. I love Nintendo products. You guys know this. Um, we are planning on going to the Nintendo Center coming up in February. So I do want to go back there again. I do have some great videos with a Nintendo media event back um, a year or two ago. That was a lot of fun. And of course, the guy who does the voice for Mario was there. I got to meet him and that was a lot of fun. Cool guy, uh, but just really, really cool. Check out Super Mario and all of his Mario glory here. Very cool. Um, maybe they'll do a Sonic one for the Sonic movie coming out in February. That'd be kind of cool too. So we'll check out Mario. I've been playing a lot of the new Pokemon too on Switch. Um, if you guys want to add me to your friends list, let me know and I'll send you the code or I'll put it down below in the description. You can just add me, but I do have um, a lot of YouTube people on my friends list. So feel free to add me if you're into that kind of thing. So anyway, very cool. You can see what I'm playing and you'll see that I do play Super Mario. Although right now I'm all about the Pokemons. Love the new Pokemon shield. So much fun. All right, back to the pin. Very cool. We got Mario in a little coin there. So that's really cool. He's wearing a signature blue and red with his little Mario hat. And it looks like he's ready for some cool a smash in action with his little fist in the air so very cool um really nice pin and of course mario is like it's my favorite series i absolutely adore mario so much fun and we do have a black stopper on a nice thick card stock so very cool uh great third one man like this set right now even if it's only three pins these are all super winners man and we got two more to go i believe in my set let's see you can actually subscribe different sizes um you can do a three pin oops you can do a three pin uh five pin or the full on, or actually, I'm sorry, now I'm getting all confused. It's three, four, or five. So, all right, let's see what we have all next. Right, our next pin is, oh, it's Superman. Oh my gosh. Um, Superman, like, I've never been the biggest Superman fan, I'll be honest with you guys. Um, not a big comic book guy. I do like comics, you know, but it's like about Superman, just it really, um, I don't know, it just is not my favorite one. Although I will say this pin is very super, so very cool. It's got the retro cool Superman with the, the shiny black hair there, and he's looking all chiseled on the cheek, and uh, definitely already in classic Superman red and uh, blue, which is cool. I think part of the problem with Superman is like the new Superman where he's just like black, kind of look like, and that was like Superman versus Batman or whatever it was. He just, it didn't really stand out as Superman to me. I don't know, but uh, very cool. Loving the retro Superman. We'll check this out. They did such a good job with the Joker. Um, I'm hoping that DC will be able to come back and kind of make a really cool Superman movie down the road. It could be my next favorite thing, perhaps. But very, very cool. Loving the red cardstock. Superman. Uh, looking good. Um, nice pin. Yeah. Good stuff, man. Uh, of course, they use the shiny colors. And, of course, the red and the yellow pop together real nice. So, really nice likeness. If you're into Superman, uh, this pin is probably right up your alley. And this might make me a fan of Superman yet. Okay, we'll see here. Maybe they'll do the whole Justice League. Uh, hopefully, if they do the Justice League, I hope they do. Remember the Justice League cartoon? It'd be amazing, actually, if they did the Wonder Twins. Okay, I think that would be kind of fun like wonder twins activate you know like uh fingers crossed i'm hoping for wonder twins we'll see what happens all right and our final fifth pin is oh my gosh this could be harry potter it could be video game related um i don't think we have a lot of video well we got mario here we got mario so that's video games we got kylo ren that's movies we got uh superman so superheroes and gi joe kind of classic comics what could this be i'm hoping harry potter all right let's see what we have here and the final pin pin number five is Oh my God, it's Santa Claus. Oh, this is fantastic. I love Christmas. In fact, if you haven't watched, I do have videos. Usually I do like a Christmas haul video and you can check it out. It's my favorite time of the year. Um, so you check out my previous Christmas videos if you like, and you can see what I got. And just, I'm a big fan. So this is awesome, man. I can wait on Harry Potter for saying, okay. So really cool Santa Claus pin. Celebrate this season with Santa. That's awesome. Um, I'll be proudly wearing my Santa Claus pin. So that is great, Zany Box. Thank you so much. Nice, big, bright white beard. And of course, green and red and all the colors of Christmas. It's looking good. Even look at that. He's on the sleigh right there. Little picture there on the cardstock. Very cool. Okay, to recap, this is the most recent Zanny Box, and I do want to apologize that my voice has been giving out, so I'm a, a day or two behind in making this video, but I'm super happy I got to do this today. My voice actually so far has held out, so that's awesome. Fingers crossed they'll keep up, but I love the Zanny Box. Um, fantastic box, great assortment, great variety of things. I mean, from video games, we got Mario, movies, we got Kylo Ren, super relevant right now, G.I. Joe, so much fun and collectible, and Superman, which I know a lot of people really do love Superman, so that's really cool. And of course, Santa Claus, okay? If I had to pick a favorite this month, it's tough. I mean, 
Star Wars. I've been watching that new Disney Plus Star Wars, and um, I'm really into Star Wars, so I like that. But of course, Mario's an all-time favorite. You know, I love G.I. Joe, but I think if I had to pick a favorite, okay, I don't want to go on the naughty list, all right? So I think this month, if I had to pick a favorite, I'm going to go with Santa, even though it's not part of a series necessarily. Tis a season to be in love with Santa. So Santa Claus, um, you're number one with me, okay? So um, Santa's my favorite, but it's tough because all these pins are a lot of fun. And again, if you're watching this video and if you have someone on your, on your shopping list that maybe hasn't tried pin collecting but was into it or maybe does it at Disney or BlizzCon or something, like it's great. There's so many fun pins and these guys make great collectible pins. I'd highly recommend clicking the, the link down below and subscribe and you can do like a three package or four package, five package. There's different sizes to meet your needs and price, but there's such good pins. I mean, at a Comic-Con, a pin like this would go for easily seven or eight dollars. So it's a really great value for getting that many pins you know for that price so really really cool again um click the link you can check out all the current prices and just uh, these guys are great like out of all the pin services um these guys are the best i mean the pins are great quality they come on awesome card stock they're super collectible um they got the little sleeves even you can put them back in the sleeve and trade them and pin trading is a lot of fun because if your child like maybe it is into something let's say like video games or star wars or comics or whatever and you know maybe they're a little introverty and they want to like you know find new friends pin collecting and trading is a great way of meeting new people and having fun and making friends so it's really worth checking out and um, they're great to wear they're great to collect they're great to trade i just i love pin trading okay all right guys i'm gonna wrap up this video but thank you uh, zanny box fantastic package love the flex santa claus is in there that is super cool and i hope you guys have a fantastic holiday season okay um thanks for watching this video i really appreciate it and don't forget i'm gonna be doing a giveaway right now we're in the advanced entry period so you can say enter me or enter me senpai for your name in the hat for my next giveaway okay and again i will include some zanny box pins some mystery pins okay so if you say hey tux i'm more into gaming i'll try and throw some mystery gaming pins if you're more into comics or movies or pop culture let me know and i aim to please let me see what i can do for you okay but um guys thanks for watching we'll talk to you soon okay bye bye Thank <laughs> you.